Hello friends, this video on body movements part 9 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. So let us discuss about bone. So bone is a strong and non-flexible tissue. So if you look at it, when, when any part of our body moves, the bone as such doesn't bend or it doesn't rotate. So those kind of flexibility is not there with the bone. But it is just that the points where bone is attached to something else at those points, the points are movable and that is why the movements are possible. It forms the framework of the body. So when you look at this uh, structure, what you see, this is our entire skeletal system. So let us say, if you look at the, uh, say, foot. So when you focus on the foot, this is how the uh, fingers are, right? So what are the bones? You see, this is one bone. This is here. If you look at this part, you have so many bones. One, two, three, four, five, six. There are so many bones. In fact, in one finger itself, you have two, two bones. Multiple bones are there in one finger itself. So when you look at it more minutely, this each part is actually made up of structures like this. And these are what? These are nothing but bone. So all these bones, so when you focus on the finger, you see this is the point where the bones are joined. So this is the point where you can curve your finger or you can bend your finger. So bone forms the basic framework of the body. So as I said that in an adult, there are 206 bones which exist. Now the bones are, or the skeletal system is covered by skin and tissues because of which it is not visible. Now there are various bones in our body. So bones of the upper limb, upper limb would be our hands, lower limb would be the legs, rib cage, back bone, shoulder bones, pelvic bones. So when you look at your structure, you, these are your upper limbs. So the bones present in these bones, these are all examples of bones of upper limb. Similarly, when you focus at the lower limb, this is one bone, this is another bone, this one is yet another bone. So these bones of the fingers, these are all bones of lower limb. Rib cage. So this cage-like structure which you see, that is also made up of bones. So that is rib cage. Back bone. So towards the back side, just towards the back side of the rib cage, you have this entire bony structure starting just below the head till the pelvic area towards the back side so that is the back bone shoulder bones here you have the shoulder bones so these bones are the shoulder bones which allow movement as in the shoulder region pelvic bones so these are the pelvic bones so the pelvis region again that region also shows some kind of uh, movement like right? for example when you sit so that sitting is possible because the pelvic bones are also capable of movement. So these are pelvic bones. So these are the important bones which are, which are present in our Thank you. Please visit www.examfear.com to watch more educational videos with a better experience. Please do not forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel for latest updates. Thank you once again.